In March 2019, a team of archaeologists in Egypt was excavating an ancient burial ground. This place held the remains of early pharaohs who were buried thousands of years ago beneath tombs and pyramids, hidden from public view as different dynasties ruled the land. Despite the challenges, the researchers persisted in their efforts and made an incredible discovery. They found a tomb that was 4,400 years old, and inside it, they found paintings that were incredibly well preserved. Since the 1800s, groups of archaeologists have been exploring the ruins of Saqqara, looking for artifacts and clues about the fascinating history of Egypt. In the first dynasty of ancient Egypt, the earliest nobles were buried in a place called Saqqara. This area holds thousands of years of history hidden beneath its arid and rocky ground. In July 2018, a valuable burial mask was discovered at Saqqara, bringing attention to the ongoing excavations. But the most impressive find occurred in March 2019 when archaeologists stumbled upon a tomb in an extraordinary state of preservation despite its ancient age. Today, when we think of ancient Egypt, we often remember famous landmarks like the Pyramids of Giza and the Great Sphinx. But there is so much more to discover in this ancient burial ground at Saqqara. Around 3100 BC, the Egyptian kingdom covered much of the Nile Valley and became the most influential civilization in the Mediterranean for nearly 3,000 years. This period, starting with the first pharaoh, marked the beginning of the first dynasty, which lasted for about 30 centuries. Over time, different dynasties ruled the ancient kingdom until the first century BC when it became part of the Roman Empire. Even though the kings of ancient Egypt eventually disappeared, their impact on the region is still evident today. Throughout history, the pharaohs displayed their immense wealth by constructing lavish and intricate tombs. Even now, we continue to discover monuments dedicated to these rulers who have long since passed away. Their legacy and influence on Egyptian history remain visible in the structures and artifacts that have survived through the ages. Many thousands of years ago, as mentioned earlier, Saqqara was a treasure trove of historical riches. It's located less than an hour's drive south of the famous Giza Pyramid Complex and is linked to Memphis, the ancient capital of Egypt. Memphis was founded during the time of the first pharaoh and was situated along the banks of the Nile River. At its peak, Memphis was home to around 30,000 people, making it the most populous settlement in the world during that era. Experts say that the first kings buried at Saqqara were from the Second Dynasty, and they were laid to rest in underground galleries. But many other pharaohs were also buried there, and their tombs and monuments can still be seen at the site today. Saqqara remained an important burial ground for the rulers of ancient Egypt for generations. Saqqara Necropolis has been a spiritually significant place even up to Roman times. Today it stretches over four miles in length and almost a mile across. Since the 19th century, curious explorers have been venturing into its tunnels and tombs to learn about the ancient world. However, in the early days of archaeology in the region, there was looting, and many valuable artifacts were taken unlawfully. One of the most famous structures at Saqqara is the Pyramid of Djoser, the resting place of the Third Dynasty ruler bearing the same name. This pyramid is believed to date back to the 27th century BC, making it one of the oldest intact stone building complexes in the world. Although parts of the Djoser Pyramid Complex were excavated during the 19th century, there are still many secrets buried beneath the ground, waiting to be discovered. The Necropolis of Saqqara is a vast site that holds immense historical and archaeological importance. It has witnessed the burial of numerous pharaohs and nobles throughout ancient Egyptian history. Explorations in recent times have shed new light on this ancient burial ground, providing insights into the beliefs, culture, and practices of the past. Despite the unfortunate history of looting, ongoing efforts by responsible archaeologists continue to unearth and preserve the rich heritage hidden within the tombs and structures of Saqqara, helping us to better understand the fascinating world of ancient Egypt. From 1982 to 1986, a total of 35 tombs were discovered in the Saqqara necropolis. As the years went by, more incredible finds emerged from this ancient burial ground. In July 2018, archaeologists uncovered a rare burial mask made of gilded silver, a truly remarkable discovery. Just four months later, they made another surprising find, seven tombs buried beneath the necropolis, each containing mummified remains of cats and scarab beetles. But the discoveries didn't stop there. In December 2018, Egyptian officials announced the finding of yet another tomb, estimated to be around 4,400 years old. This tomb was filled with incredibly well-preserved sculptures and paintings, offering a fascinating glimpse into the distant past. 
Sakura continues to reveal its secrets, and the ongoing excavations hold the promise of unearthing even more wonders from this ancient and spiritually significant site. On April 13, 2019, there was an incredible announcement from Egyptian officials. An archaeological expedition led by Mohamed Magahid from the Czech Institute of Archaeology had been excavating near the Saqqara necropolis. During their dig, they discovered several fascinating tombs believed to be from the 5th dynasty, which began over 4,000 years ago when Pharaoh Usurkov came into power. This period in Egyptian history lasted for around 150 years until the mid-24th century BC, when the last ruler of the dynasty, Pharaoh Unas, passed away. The team had located a number of tombs from the 5th dynasty at the site near Saqqara. Additionally, they found a granite column with a dedication to Queen Setbior engraved on it. Setibor was the wife of King Jetkare, and she was one of the last queens of the dynasty. But the most exciting part was yet to be revealed. At a conference attended by many officials, more remarkable discoveries were unveiled, adding to our understanding of this ancient civilization. In March 2019, the Egyptian Antiquities Minister made an exciting announcement about a new tomb discovery. Archaeologists found a truly remarkable tomb from the time of the 5th dynasty, which was more than 4,000 years old. Despite its great age, the interior of the tomb was incredibly well preserved, and the colorful paintings on the walls looked as fresh and vibrant as if they were just painted recently. The tomb was believed to have belonged to a man named Kawi, who was an important official during the 5th dynasty. The tomb's design is unique, shaped like the letter L, and it starts with a small corridor leading downwards into an antechamber. From there, it opens up into a larger chamber adorned with beautifully painted reliefs. These paintings depict Kawi seating at an offerings table, suggesting his significance and role in ancient Egyptian society. The discovery of Kawi's tomb offers us valuable insights into the art, culture, and customs of ancient Egypt during the 5th dynasty. It's a testament to the skilled craftsmanship of that era and the importance placed on honoring and preserving the memory of prominent individuals. Excavations like these continue to enrich our understanding of this fascinating ancient civilization. So who was Kelly and why did he have such an elaborate tomb? Based on al Ani's statement, the design of Kelly's tomb was inspired by the pyramids of the 5th dynasty, suggesting that he might have been a person of great importance. The tomb's entrance was constructed in a style commonly seen in Pharaoh's resting places, adding to its significance. The vibrant paintings in the tomb provide another clue about Kelly's identity. Experts believe they were made with special royal hues, including a unique green resin. While there's no evidence to suggest that Kawi was a member of the ruling elite, some think he had a close relationship with King Shatkare. So Kawi's elaborate tomb and the way it was decorated indicate that he had a prominent position during the 5th dynasty and he might have been close to the ruling king. Jadkari was an ancient Egyptian ruler who came to power around the late 25th or mid 24th century BC. He ruled for an impressive 44 years or more. Jadkari is known for breaking tradition by not building a temple dedicated to the sun god Ra, unlike other kings of his time. Instead, he focused on expeditions to Sinai to find precious metals and goods. Under his rule, Egypt also expanded into the neighboring territory of Canaan. However, Shetkari's most significant legacy lies in the reforms he implemented across ancient Egypt. He drastically changed the government by centralizing power and creating a system similar to feudalism. While some historians think his approach wasn't ideal and may have contributed to the eventual decline of the Egyptian state, Shetkari's reign marked a significant period of change. He also made important reforms to the funerary cults of his time, which governed burial rituals believed to ensure a safe passage into the afterlife. After Shidkari's death, he became the subject of his own cult, and even as the 5th dynasty transitioned to the 6th, he continued to be held in high regard. In fact, his reverence endured until the time of the Old Kingdom, approximately 200 years later. Shidkari's reign left a lasting impact on Egypt's history, both through his rule and the significant changes he introduced to the government and funerary practices of ancient Egypt. Shidkari, the 5th dynasty ruler, was laid to rest in Saqqara, and his tomb was marked by a massive stepped pyramid towering over 170 feet tall. Unfortunately, the tomb was targeted by looters over the years. Archaeological excavations in the 1940s aimed to uncover more about Shidkari's life, but many details about him still remain unknown. One intriguing aspect is Jedkari's potential relationship with Kawi, the official whose tomb was found nearby. The elaborate and grand nature of Kawi's burial suggests a close connection with the pharaoh. Some even believe that they might have been related, possibly family members. 
The lavish decorations in Cowie's tomb are thought to be related to the reform Shedkari introduced during his reign. The discovery of Cowie's tomb holds great significance for experts. They hope that studying this burial site will provide valuable insights into Shedkari's life and reign. And additionally, they seek to understand why Shedkari was revered and worshipped long after his death. The exploration of these tombs offers a unique opportunity to unravel the mystery surrounding the 5th Dynasty ruler and shed light on the ancient history of Egypt. Inside Cowie's tomb, in addition to the mesmerizing paintings, archaeologists made an intriguing discovery of pieces known as canopic jars. These ancient vessels were used to carefully store the preserved organs of the deceased during the embalming process. Although there's still much to uncover, the tomb has garnered significant attention from around the world. On April 13, 2019, more than 50 ambassadors were invited to visit the site near Sakura by the Egyptian Antiquities Minister Al-Anani. The group consisted of dignitaries and cultural representatives, among them the renowned Egyptian singer and actress Yusra. The gathering posed for photographs beside the captivating archaeological find. Experts are thrilled with the remarkable discoveries that holds the potential to provide valuable insights into the life and reign of Jedkare. In 2011, Egypt was expecting a steady flow of tourists throughout the year. However, fate had other plans. On January 25th, protests erupted around the country against the government's increasing brutality and corruption. These demonstrations, led by various youth groups, continued for over two weeks, causing social unrest. In just a few days, one million visitors had to leave their holidays and exit the country due to the turmoil. Although President Mubarak eventually stepped down on February 11, 2011, political instability persisted in Egypt for several years. As a result, the number of tourists visiting the country remained low. Before the revolution, tourism accounted for about 10% of Egypt's jobs. However, after the unrest, the tourist industry suffered staggering losses of around $1 billion every month. To make matters worse, in 2015, a tragic incident further impacted tourism. A Russian Airbus A321 plane crashed over the Sinai Peninsula, allegedly due to a bomb. The aircraft broke apart after departing from the popular tourist town of Sharm El Sheikh, resulting in the loss of more than 200 lives. Several countries suspended flights to this beach resort in response to the incident, affecting tourism even further. The combination of political unrest and this tragic plane crash dealt a severe blow to Egypt's tourism industry, hindering its recovery and causing significant economic losses. The country faced considerable challenges in reviving its once thriving tourist sector and restoring confidence among international travelers. In 2017, tourists began returning to Egypt and the trend continued the following year with over 11 million people choosing the country as their holiday destination. The tourism industry showed signs of recovery, and officials are eager to bring back visitor numbers to the level seen before the 2011 revolution. Fortunately, recent years have seen an astonishing number of historic discoveries in the region. The Egyptian Antiquities Minister declared 2018 as the year of archaeological discovery, reflecting the continuous stream of exciting findings. Each week seemed to bring new and fascinating developments in the field of archaeology, and authorities are hopeful that these new discoveries, including the remarkable find at Saqqara in March 2019, will further boost Egypt's tourist industry. Many people have shown immense interest in these discoveries as seen by the hundreds of likes and retweets on the Ministry of Antiquities photographs from inside Kawi's tomb. It appears that our fascination with ancient Egypt remains as strong as ever, and these captivating findings could play a vital role in reviving tourism in the country. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to our channel.